advanced way of communication using english idioms the first is the context would be something related to weakening a person okay or causing loss to a person okay i want to say that the bank weakened him or caused him loss by terminating or withholding or halting his request for loan okay so what would be the uh, idioms that could replace uh, weakening the power of someone i can say the bank clipped his wings by withholding his request for loan second idiom is by withholding his request for loan the bank reduced him to penury by terminating or his request for loan the bank sapped his strength by terminating or halting his request for loan the bank rained on his parade rain on his parade means to make one upset or you may also say they crippled him or immobilized him okay the second frame of reference would be something related to a coward a person who is easily frightened or a person is a coward uh, i can say in that could the idioms that could replace coward or a scared person would be he is such such a chicken hearted he is so chicken hearted he is such a namby pamby he is such a milk and water or he is so weak need now another idiom is he is so wishy washy now you could use this idiom wishy washy for an approach you can relate it to an approach or a person he has got a wishy washy approach towards his job or task it could also be addressed or related to a person the third is i want to say to my friend that yes you have to speak it out openly outrightly you should not back off you should not withdraw instead you have to speak out you have to open it up so what would be the idioms related to that i would you uh, we can say call a spade a spade okay it means to speak something outright and very directly or i may also say that don't beat around the bush or put it straight from your shoulder or just speak it out bear your heart next is hey lay your cards on the table this is what i learned today that's all for today thank you